Wali ambayo sasa imeandaliwa vema ni kwamba kiongozi wa muungano wa azimio la umoja Raila Odinga anasema kuwa muungano huo utarejea ukiwa na nguvu mpya wakati wa uchaguzi mkuu wa 2027 akizungumza mjini Mombasa baada ya kuhudhuria ibada katika kanisa la Kianglikani mjini humo Raila alisema muungano huo utafanywa marekebisho ili uimarike vema zaidi na kunyakuwa kiti cha urais katika uchaguzi huo Grace Nganga na arifu zaidi kwa siku kadhaa kinara wa ODM Raila Odinga amekuwa katika ziara kaunti ya Mombasa na leo hii baada ya kuhudhuria ibada ya Jumapili alikuwa na tangazo kwa wafuasi wake akiahidi kuimarisha muungano wa azimio la umoja na vyama tanzu ili kukabiliana na Rais William Ruto katika uchaguzi wa mwaka 2027 kisha akapuzilia mbali madai kwamba chama cha ODM kinafifia na kuwa muungano wa azimio umesambaratika baada ya kushindwa katika uchaguzi mkuu wa mwaka uliopita like nothing like a power struggle within azimio uh, everything will be done very smoothly you're going to strengthen azimio as you also strengthen the constituent parties of the coalition Kumekuwa na madai ya mgawanyiko katika uongozi wa muungano wa azimio la umoja baada ya rais mstaafu Uhuru Kenyatta kusemekana kuwa atajiondoa kama mwenyekiti wa muungano huo lakini kulingana na Raila Uhuru Kenyatta bado yupo katika azimio I was with him just yesterday even I talked to him this morning he has not given me any impression that he's going to resign from azimio Uhuru is very much member and part and parcel of Azimio leadership. Kisha akaelekeza cheche za maneno dhidi ya mwenyekiti wa IBC wa Fula Chebukati kuhusiana na jinsi alivyoendesha uchaguzi mkuu uliopita akitaka uchunguzi wa kina kufanyika kuhusiana na matokeo yaliyotangazwa na Chebukati. But can you know exactly who won or who lost the elections? Then the president said audit begin first by auditing Mr. Chebukati. Where was he? For the last 8 years when he disappeared. And where did he get the results that he announced? That is the question that must be asked. If you can answer those questions, Kenya will be happy. Kenya will be happy. Mzozo kuhusu wizi wa kura katika uchaguzi mkuu uliopita unazidi kutokota huku rais William Ruto akidai kuwa kulikuwa na njama ya kutumia jeshi kumnyima ushindi kauli ambayo Raila amepuuzilia mbali The military could not have done a coup against itself That actually is a fallacy How would the government that done a coup against itself What has what happened is what all Kenyans know The coup which was done by civilian coup by one called Mr wa fula shebukati four against three the four commissioners said they don't agree with shebukati announced and shebukati says is the one who had the, the, the figures so you ask yourself who is lying to kenyans who is telling the truth that is what i'm talking about that is what kenyans must know because there will be no point in kenya going again in 2027 to vote if at the end of the day you end up in such a, a, a charade and a chaotic situation like we saw at the bombers of Kenya Mikakati ya kuteua makamishna wapya wa tume ya uchaguzi inatarajiwa kuanza huku Chebukati na makamishna Abdi Gulie na Boya Mwolu wakitarajiwa kuondoka afisini chini ya siku kumi zijazo Grace Nga KT News Nairobi